Okay, this one is going to be one that we're going to dive in quickly. So just hit the like button right away, guys. If we get an insane number of likes on this video, we're going to keep the videos rolling about this new intense update and all the secrets and everything that we haven't even really scraped the surface of. But this is starting to get absolutely crazy because first and foremost guys if you don't know brookhaven just updated there's a new brookhaven update out right now don't worry about all this stuff down there dude but there's a new brookhaven update out right now and in that update is a new military base estate the new military base estate involves and includes a lot of cool new features and things that are just going to surprise you and blow your noodle off but what and foremost that this video is going to be about is talking about the jet I know, I, I can't, I do, I can't believe it either. I, 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 I really can't believe it. There's a real exit, a flyable jet in Brookhaven now, dude. We have been talking about this forever, and I have been freaking out ever since I found out about this, dude. I don't know if I can remain calm in this video. So, for a warning in advance, I'm not gonna be too calm because it is a jet and we have been wanting a jet in Brookhaven since the earliest days we've been playing around with the idea talking about it you know and, 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 and being actual guys I really didn't think a jet was going to happen like it was a very strong fantasy like I was like dude a jet would be the coolest thing I don't want to go to the north estate dude I want to go to the south estate because I always go to the north estate it's time to give the other estate some love the other lots of land um but yeah and I honestly thought for the longest time there is no way we could possibly ever consider seeing a jet in Brookhaven. I mean, it's a bit outlandish. Jets are fast. It would be able to go through all of Brookhaven in like two seconds, right, with the speed that that thing has. We don't have flyable planes. We've never had any flyable planes. So why now of all times would Wolfpack just decide to give us a jet? Well, I don't know. He did though. And with the military base estate, what better way to kick off a massive new estate then well giving us this guys that means the estate game pass over here if you want access to the military base as well this is what you have to have purchased the estates unlocked this pass is permanent once you buy it and will gain you access to all the estates access to north and south estate lots which are the lots that i'm at right now these bigger lots give you the unique ability for more roleplay options currently six structures available which include three mansions a prison a hotel and a military base which is of course what we're talking about now so like i said you have to own that game pass yes i'm not gonna lie to you guys it is the more pricier game pass that you can purchase okay this one's definitely pricey i i don't make the rules wolfpack does but uh, right here are the game uh, or the estates that you get in the game pass this is the new one here a new rp set which is a military base now once we spawn that in it's about to get crazy there's so much more to look at in this military base that we just really haven't got the touch base on <laughs> touch base on but anyways look look so that's what we're hopefully going to be doing in the few upcoming days finding that safe or finding out how to get to the safe is another thing a lot of people want to know remember you got a helicopter pad here you could spawn your helicopter pretty nice you got a nice tower over there there is a giant turret gun which i actually didn't get to check to see if that gun works i'm actually curious now dude well, let's go check to see if this big turret works okay can i get in oh what dude <laughs> dude i was not expecting that to work that is insane can i launch these missiles though that's my next question can i launch some missiles dude it's just so nuts guys i was not expecting all this so you might be at what is this here what is this weird piece of land that says danger keep out that's where your jet's gonna uh, arrive at guys now when i say i've not even fully explored everything in here i mean it like there's still so much i have not even seen of this yet that i'm kind of learning for the first time with you guys like this whole control room here this is the first time i've seen any of this there's buttons here that we don't really know what they do but something has to open the safe location dude i know that for that much but uh yeah so Anyways, though, if we go on into the basement, this is where things get really, really crazy. So if we come down in here, you will see all kinds of strange things. I mean, doors that lead into different rooms that have guns that have all kinds of stuff going on. And, well, yeah, this area right here is where you're going to see something pop up that says the jet. And this is where you're going to be able to get the jet. So now we can open the door there that uh, I was showcasing you guys. I ain't gonna lie, the door opening sound is kind of scary, but that's fine. That's fine. That's fine, Wolfpack. Thank you for the sound effects. Uh, but yeah, 
right here is the jet now you will notice this little emblem above the jet so if you're clicking on the jet and it's not appearing and it's not working for you the reason for that is because you have to have premium now premium is going to gain you access to the helicopters normally the pools for your house normally and in this case the jet however the premium pass is permanent it's one of the more uh, if you're going to buy any of the game passes, I would recommend premium, then the estate game pass. What you, but if you guys see where this is going, you kind of have to have the estate game pass and the premium game pass to really get all the value out of it. So let's spawn it, and right there is our wonderful jet. Now, fun fact about this jet, it can spawn in different, loca different directions. One time I spawned it, and it was this way. Now it's that way. So um, this is the jet that we're looking at here. It is a beautiful jet. Mm, it, it just looks gorgeous. I can admire and enjoy this, guys. Look at this. We've waited a long time on this, and I have to say I am blown away, actually, that this is this is real. So you guys can get in the jet. When you press this button here, it's going to lift the jet off, dude. This, I can't believe it, dude. I'm telling you, I can't believe it. So once you do that, now, you might be thinking, what's next? Well, you know, you can customize your jet. You can add some different color coordination to it if you want. You can make it all black, put the camo, or you can do this nice gray default. So, once you do that, you're one step away now, guys. All you have to do is start increasing the speed of your jet, and you can take this thing off, dude. So, let's go max speed, dude. This thing can actually go 200 miles per hour, and it's fast, dude. Let's go under here. Whoa, dude, this is so crazy. Okay, I'm already enjoying flying around the arc. Flying around Brookhaven is never gonna get like, dude, this is this is this is it. This is it. I don't know how much to tell you guys, but this is literally it, dude. This is the coolest thing ever. Okay, nothing gets better than this, dude. So yeah, the jet. Now we can do jet. Oh, can I go under that? Oh no, dude, that is a bit rough. That's a bit rough. Not gonna lie, my flying ability is needs some. I need some flying classes. I might have to take some flying classes for my jet, dude. That was a bit rough trying to go under the bridge there. Uh, but uh, let's see if we can do some more. Let's go under this bridge. Oh, yeah, dude. Flawless. Under the Brookhaven stable sign. Oh, dude, you can't top me. Now, I wonder if I can go through the barn. Through the barn. Is that going to be possible? I don't know, dude. I'm going to try it. I'm going to try to go through the barn. Okay, let's let's do this. This is this is a bad idea. This is a bad idea. This is a bad idea, dude. I told you it was a bad idea. <laughs> Dude, what happened? What happened? Nobody seen nothing. Nobody seen nothing. It was a total normal, normal, dude. Nobody seen anything at all. Don't even say it. You didn't see it, okay? Let's try it from this angle, okay? I'm sure to be successful this time, dude. Sure, sure. Okay, nice and easy. Nice and easy. Ooh, we did that, dude. I cannot believe we actually did that. That is absolutely insane. Okay, so now if we want to slow down, we got to really tone our speed down, right? We gotta tone our speed down. Now let's go back to our estate and see if we can land this baby nice and easy. All right, so let's go ahead and get back over here. Okay, okay, yes, yes, nice and slow, coming down. Let's see if we can successfully land a jet here. Okay, okay. Right, and then we're just gonna drop it down. Ooh, I might have pulled this off. Holy moly, dude, that was close. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, okay, dude. I'm a professional. What can I say? Sign me up for the Top Gun, dude. All right, so this is pretty nice. This is pretty nice. So now we can close it back up. That's that creepy door sound, dude. I don't like it, dude. I don't like it. So I'm going to be honest, guys. This military base does have some creepy heebie-jeebies to it. Look how dark it is down here, okay? My flashlight's not even working. What's wrong with my flashlight? Okay, so my flashlight's not even working. Oh, there it is. Dude, this place is creepy down here, dude. So, yeah, there's some creepy stuff down here. The floor is, like, all cracked and stuff. You just got these weird, like, open areas. This right here, I don't have access to, guys. I could press this button, but it doesn't do anything because I have to activate something else to get in there. And that's actually the safe location, which I'm still trying to figure out right now how to get into the safe location or what I got to do to get that power activated to the door. I mean, if we're looking, guys, you're seeing there's not really no power down here, right? So I think the first thing that we need to really consider is figuring out how we're going to get power down in the basement of this. So uh, basically, my guess is we go up here somewhere, maybe go to the control room on the second floor. Let's go check that out. Uh -huh. Let's go up here. There's some switches here. Okay. Um... I don't see anything that's pre oh oh missile ready we can launch the missiles we can launch the missiles dude i this is the first time i've launched the missiles dude i didn't know you could do that 
Not gonna lie, didn't know you could do that one. That's pretty cool. Um, okay, there's a piece of paper here that has some writing on it. Okay, I don't see nothing that really activates the basement lights. No, wait, I activated it. Okay, so one of the switches up there activated a lot of the lights down here, but it still didn't activate this thing. So that's something I got to figure out, I guess, guys. That's something I got to figure out for another video. Anyways, this video was how to access the jet. Hopefully it helped you. With that being said, I'm going to get on out of here, guys. I got more videos to dissect and look at in regards to this, dude. This is getting crazy. Love you guys. See you in the next one.